Let's add the fractions 3 eighths plus 3 sixteenths. And here's how you do it. So what we need to do is get a common denominator. That's the number down here. We want this to be the same. Because if this is the same, we just add the numerators together and we're done. We could just take 2 times 8, because that would equal 16. We already have 16 here. But if we multiply the denominator here by a number, we need to also multiply the numerator by that number. It's because here, 2 over 2, just 2 divided by 2, that's 1. So we're multiplying by 1. We don't change the value just the way it's written. 2 times 3 is 6, and 2 times 8, that's 16. And 6 sixteenths, that's the same as 3 eighths. They're equivalent fractions. Over here, we already have that 3 sixteenths. And now, because we have the same denominator here, we're just going to keep that the same. And when we add fractions, we add the numerators. 6 plus 3 is 9. And we end up with 3 eighths plus 3 sixteenths. That equals 9 sixteenths. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.